Hello and welcome to Flickin Facts. We are here with another amazing video to make your life happy, smarter and healthier. Click subscribe and push the notification button if you haven't done that already. Now, let's get started. Hello and welcome to Flickin Fats. It's not just processed meat and smoking which gives you cancer. Sometimes surprising choices can put you at a higher risk. Cancer is caused by changes in cell DNA. Some changes may be passed down from our parents in the form of genetic defects, while others could be caused by environmental factors. Flick in Facts brings you a list of everyday objects and activities that can cause cancer. So let's get started. Number 20. Fake Tanning Tanning beds use ultraviolet light, and prolonged exposure ups your odds of developing melanoma, the deadliest kind of skin cancer. Even one tanning bed session can increase your risk of developing melanoma by 20%. So don't think that indoor tan is safer and healthier for you than tanning in the sun. Number 19. Processed meat. Processed meats like hot dogs, ham, bacon, sausages and salami are carcinogenic. Also, an excess of red meat is clearly linked to cancer. The World Health Organization considers bacon, lunch meat and sausages to be carcinogens because they contain compounds known as nitrites or nitrates. It's important to read labels. Some manufacturers remove the nitrites and nitrates from the manufacturing process. Number 18. Using makeup and skincare containing parabens. Not all beauty products are good for your skin. Parabens are used as preservatives in a countless number of makeup and skincare products. They're easily absorbed through the skin and can cause a spike in the growth of breast cancer cells. Now, with the natural beauty movement taking off, there's no reason to put products on your body that have any sort of potentially harmful chemicals. Number 17. Sleeping with your phone next to your head. You might like falling asleep to your favorite podcast, but get your phone as far away from your head as possible. Cell phones are the major red flag when we think of electronic devices that may be a cause for concern. Cancerous or not, holding our cell phones against our heads could contribute to tumors. So putting your phone far away guarantees a better and healthy sleep. Number 16. Frequent Flying Did you know the breast cancer rate in female flight attendants is 50% higher than in women in other professions? Their non-melanoma skin cancer rate is four times higher. One possible explanation for these increased rates is that flight attendants are exposed to a lot of known and potential carcinogens or cancer-causing agents within their work environment. Cabin crews are also at an increased risk of cervix, thyroid, colon, liver and stomach cancer. Number 15. Alcoholic Beverages There's much research to suggest that regular consumption of alcohol can account for an increased risk of cancer in both men and women. Alcoholic beverages consumption is a cause of breast, colorectal, larynx, liver, esophagus, oral cavity and pharynx cancers and as a probable cause of pancreatic cancer. Limiting your alcohol consumption can positively impact your life in many ways. You'll almost definitely reduce your cholesterol which will also help prevent cancer. Number 14. Sitting too much. Those times when you're sitting around relaxing probably feeling great. The only issue is too much sitting can put you at a risk of cancer. Physical activity and exercise could potentially lower your risk of developing different cancers and other chronic illnesses. Sedentary behavior such as sitting or lying down for extended periods of time can drastically increase your risk of cancer, especially colon and endometrial cancer. 
Number 13. Getting your nails done. Many customers now know that nail polishes traditionally contain cancer-causing compounds. The UV lights used to cure or dry or gel polish have some consumers concerned about the risk for skin cancer. Not only the clients, but manicurists are also at an increased risk of being diagnosed with multiple myeloma. If you're a manicurist or simply love getting your nails done, make sure to only go to salons that provide gloves and masks. Check for proper ventilation as well. Number 12. Working a late night shift. A study reported by the British Medical Journal found that night shift work increased the risk of several types of cancer. Researchers found that those who had worked nights for 30 or more years were twice as likely to have developed cancer. Experts aren't sure why though. It could be the loss of sleep, disrupted body rhythms, exposure to light at night, or a combination of any of these. If possible, avoid working at odd hours. When that's not possible, try to ensure that you're getting regular sleep, even if it's not at night. Number 11. High temperature cooking. Higher cooking temperatures can create chemical reactions that may produce dangerous carcinogens that can damage our DNA. Cooking meat at high temperatures could have potentially negative effects on our health and gastrointestinal tracts. Now don't freak out and throw your barbecue grill off the balcony just yet. Instead, go easy on grilling and roasting. Number 10. Diabetes. Here's some bad news. Having either type 1 or type 2 diabetes can put you at a higher risk for cancer. Women with diabetes are at a higher risk than men. They're 27% more likely to develop cancer, while men are only 19% more likely. Maintaining a normal blood sugar level with both type 1 and type 2 diabetes can help to reduce the risk. Scientists believe that consistently high blood sugar may trigger the DNA mutations that can increase the danger of cancer. So work with your doctor to manage your blood sugar. Number 9. Being overweight. While we tend to think of heart disease risk or diabetes as main health reasons to avoid gaining weight, we should include cancer as well. Overweight and obesity are the biggest risk factors after smoking, attributable to about 8% of all cancers in 2014. So guys, get rid of that excess weight putting you in a lot of danger. Number 8. Using scented candles. There's something so soothing about scented candles, right? But though they do relax you almost immediately in the moment, they can also do a whole lot of damage down the road. Frequent usage or inhalation of these dangerous pollutants drifting in the air could contribute to the development of health risks like cancer. Number 7. Having unprotected sex. Having unprotected sex also comes with its own dangers. Most notably, it puts you at risk for contracting STIs like HPV and chlamydia, both of which have been linked to increased cancer risks. Practicing safer sex will help you to protect against many sexually transmitted diseases. Number 6. Fermented Foods While fermented foods can have a number of health benefits, there's an increasing reason to believe that some fermented foods can increase your risk of cancer. Some research has been floating around that shows a connection between fermented foods and esophageal cancer. We're not suggesting you cut fermented foods out of your life completely, especially since the probiotics they provide can be beneficial to gut health. However, do be mindful of how much you're eating and check the ingredient lists if you're not making your own fermented foods. Number 5. Chewing Tobacco Some people view chewing tobacco as a safer alternative to smoking cigarettes, but smokeless tobacco can be just as harmful to your health. In addition to containing higher amounts of nicotine, oral tobacco contains at least 28 chemicals known to cause cancer. If you use any smokeless tobacco, you're at a higher risk of mouth cancer, stomach cancer, esophageal cancer and more. Number 4. Using Talcum Powder 
Several studies have reported a strong association between the use of talcum powder on the women's perineal area from the anus to the vulva and ovarian cancer risk. A research from 2016 found that using talc on the genitals could increase the risk of ovarian cancer by 33%. According to some reports, talcum powder may also cause respiratory problems in babies if inhaled. The European Union has banned talcum powder in beauty and health products, so people cannot purchase it in certain European countries. Number 3. Trans fats There's a lot of disagreement in nutrition, but one of the few things that people actually agree on is the unhealthy nature of trans fats. Research suggests that man-made fats called trans fats can raise the risk of prostate, breast and colon cancer. Eating a healthy and well-balanced diet that is low in saturated and trans fats and high in fruits and vegetables can benefit your overall health and reduce your risk of cancer. Number 2. Heating Takeout Containers If you've ever reheated your takeout in the container it came in, then you may have put yourself at risk of exposure to styrene, and a repeated exposure to this chemical can increase your risk of cancers like leukemia and lymphoma. At home, you can limit your risk of exposure by directly transferring your takeout to a standard plate or bowl. Number 1. Inherited Risk One of the things we can't change is who our parents are, but that can mean an increased risk of certain types of cancer. The most common cancer associated with inherited gene mutations is breast cancer. This occurs when there is a mistake or a fault in the genes in an egg or sperm cell. Then the gene fault can be passed on to the children. Genes that increase the risk of cancer are called cancer susceptibility genes. Being born with one inherited faulty gene doesn't mean that a person will definitely get cancer but they have a higher risk of developing particular types of cancer than other people. Important. Cancer risk tends to increase with age. Some existing health conditions that cause inflammation may also increase your risk of cancer. Knowing the factors that contribute to cancer can help you live a lifestyle that decreases your cancer risks. Well, we hope you liked the video and found it useful. Flickin' Facts aims to dig out the facts and information that is best for your health and lifestyle. Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching.